You've probably seen this footage of a giant hole forming on the streets of Bangkok. This is a sinkhole and it's quite rightly terrifying. Imagine just going about your day, walking on the streets or driving in your car and suddenly the ground gives way. This is the reality for some people in modern day cities. This one opened just outside a hospital, which I guess is kind of good. Luckily, there were no fatalities or any injuries, but the risk is still there. You can clearly see some vehicles falling in, power lines snapping, and a massive water pipe leaking. But this isn't just a Bangkok problem. Sinkholes have swallowed entire city blocks in Guatemala, resorts in Florida, and even sidewalks and streets in China. They're unpredictable, they're violent, and they're becoming more common. But the question is, why? Well, to understand, we have to go underground. Sinkholes are basically Earth's trap doors. They form when the ground beneath the surface can no longer hold the weight above it. Here's how. The culprit is water. See, this can come from rainfall in monsoon seasons, it can come from drainage pipes, construction, and as it seeps through the soil, if the bedrock geology is made from something that can be easily dissolved, so limestone, salt, or gypsum, it will eventually create a cavity or a hollow space. Over time, this cavity will grow and grow until one day it loses all support and sinks. In Bangkok, there's still not not sure what happened as it's too early to tell, but initial investigations claim that it might be the big leaking pipe or waterlogged groundwaters due to heavy rainfall. The road looked fine until it wasn't. Sinkholes can happen anywhere, but some areas are more prone than others. They're usually places with limestone or gypsum bedrock or poorly maintained systems and massive city urbanization schemes. As cities grow, so are the pressures beneath them. And this is what makes sinkholes so scary. You don't see them coming. They're a reminder that even our modern concrete urban jungles have the power to collapse under their own weight. Now, it's unlikely that we can prevent every sinkhole, but we can do things to mitigate the risks. Cities are starting to scan with ground-penetrating radar to find voids and cavities. They're also upgrading old leaking pipe systems to ensure that no subsoil gets destabilized. And smarter urban planning to ensure we're not building on places which are prone to dissolving goes without question. Sinkholes often feel like something out of a disaster movie, and quite frankly, they could be. But in reality, they're part of an underground process we do understand and we can plan for. If you enjoyed this video on Earth Explained, like, comment, share, follow, and I'll see you in the next one.